It's something most of us aren't likely to see. On a back road north of Tillamook, along the Miami River, photographer Carl Wickman and I found them by accident. We came around another turn and there they were again, Christmas lights hanging in the cool night sky. It was almost mystical, an apparition, a ghostly image. In the daylight, the picture becomes a lot more clear, but just as special. The lights outline Gene Filosi's old dairy barn. Not many people ever see it, few people even drive these back roads, but it's kind of a special Christmas present to people in the area. It's one of those famous older Oregon barns on Gene's place, one still very much in use for the 85 head of dairy cows the family runs. Nobody in the family wanted any attention, but they figured, let's do something different. My son is the one that came up with the idea, my son Robin, my second boy, and we discussed what to do that we could show people that were here uh, about a year ago and he says why not put lights on the barn and so I says fine you want to do the do the climbing around I don't like to get up that high that thing's about 32 feet in the air and so he says okay I'll do it you buy the lights so up they went I'm not sure that uh, that I could quote anybody right now but they usually smile and they want to know who, who whose place it is, and is it yours, and uh, it really looks nice, and we're glad someone did something like this. Did you get any more milk from them because oh, of it? Oh, I, I, I wish I did, but the, <laughs> no, unfortunately not. For Gene, this is the home place. He's lived here 52 years, all of his life, seen a lot of changes, but with cities growing all the time, it's the changes he hasn't seen here he's beginning to appreciate. And now every Christmas, it's becoming a Filosi family tradition to show that they're here and they're happy. Neighbors like it that way. Along the Miami River near Tillamook, this is Bill Van Amberg.